Okay, so what we're going to be working Tubic today on is uh, forcing to the pile. And what that is, where you set up a bunch of dummies all in one pile, and we're going to work him on long distance retrieves, running straight lines, and that's what it's enforcing is running longer distance. So far, we've been working kind of short distances, you know, 20, 30, 40 yards at most. And what you risk there is if you don't start stretching them out, they'll go out 30, 40 yards, and then they'll hold up and not actually go to that you know 200 yard range so we'll we're going to try to move him in to about probably or move him out to about 150 yards today and work that uh work that pile so we'll see how he does okay as you see i've went out a little bit further here uh the first time i sent him out he went out and went to the right so i want to simplify it i moved on out uh, this retrieve was about a 75 yard retrieve at that point um you can also see him playing around with the bumpers a little bit there. I've got eight bumpers sitting out there in a pile. And what I am what I do at that point when he's playing around is he knows force fetch. Um, I give him a little bit of pressure. He fetches one and I give him the here command and, and he came on back. So I uh, did pretty good there. Okay, here you'll see me line him up, ascending goes out and then breaks to the right. Let's see right here he'll break to the right. I don't want to correct him a lot right here. I'm going to let him go ahead and hunt it up. I'm not telling him a lot. Just let him hunt it up and you'll see he'll come back and get back on that line and go out to that pile. The reason why I don't worry about correcting him much there is because these long type of drills, we'll, this is probably a drill that we'll do more than any drill that we do is, is sending him out for these long retrieves and forcing to these piles. But repetitiveness will will take care of any of this, uh, or any behaviors that he might have of breaking to the right or any of that stuff. He just dropped the bumper, so I, I wanted to work him with force fetch there. He saw me drop it in front of him and I told him fetch. So uh, he did a good job. That shows a little bit of our training, uh, continuing that we are working on force fetch. Line him up again. He's looking to the right still. There was a rock over there I took him to and he played with, but uh, now I'm marking him out front. This will be about his third time he's ever done this. He takes a pretty good line here. He looked to the right again. But you see that line was pretty good all the way to the pile. Sorry for the dogs barking in the background. It is a good uh, distraction for Tugit, but it's about the fourth time here that he goes out. Uh, sent him out. As you can see he ran pretty good straight lines. Uh, went out picked it up, come straight back, looked real good. Uh, that's about the fourth time we've done this, so uh, picked it up pretty well. I was, I was, I was pleased there. Yeah, changed the angle here a little bit, and just going to end with the a little up close and uh, personal with uh, the big man Tubic.